Alright, and welcome back to Legend of Dragoon. So, <clears throat> last week, we did boat stuff, and then we finished boat stuff. And then we fought the water dragon? So now we're back to tell uh, the king of this country. Yeah, we failed. What? Do you want to stay and do your stream thing? No, you just take me once. Nate, Nate's gonna have to leave at one point, as you can hear. You got anything new to say? Never. Recently, you feel like you're watched by somebody. Interesting. We are extremely repetitive. We never have anything new to say. I don't know what. Oh, yeah? You don't know? Well, let me tell you. It's about Princess Lisa. It seems she's in love with somebody. It's me. Okay. Oh, you girls have a wide network. Uh, I feel like... I feel like that's wrong. Uh, okay. Weird. Is that so? I was hoping for, like, actual news of stuff, not random gossip. So, uh... I'm just you go around on. and gossip in town and expect to not get random gossip. Uh, Princess Emil is here. <coughs> I forget which princess that is. She's the mean one. Well, the mean one's not mean anymore. Did we fix that? Yes, we fixed that a while back. I don't remember fixing that. Yeah, uh, it was, it was, it was an, an imposter the entire time. She was asleep. Yeah, it was the Wingly. We fought the Wingly once, then we chased across the sea and fought the Wingly a second time, and we just murdered the Wingly, who was the imposter princess, and are now back. I remember the murder. I don't remember the story at all. Well, you should pay more attention. I'm not going to. Rude. I won't be here shortly. <laughs> Very rude. Oh, rude. Uh, it is unfortunate. Wow, everyone is already down to sucking her dick. Um, she was an asshole for six months in their opinion, to, to what they know. And now everyone's like, oh, she's the greatest thing since sliced bread. But there is no sliced no, I, bread. I know that she was replaced. Oh, she, uh, he, he's just telling them now. So they no. Knew. It would have gone around town <laughs> I have returned quickly. after a half year of sleep. Are you going to tell me that the castle guards wouldn't have spread that immediately while we were going and doing stuff? Everyone knows already. Uh, I, that, that's, that's, I don't think that's how medieval times worked. That is definitely how medieval times work. My father king... I, I don't even remember what the voice I did for her. My father king Zoyer wouldn't say it, but I heard that the evil doings of the sinner who feigned to be me has harmed our people in Taboria. I don't know what voice I'm, I'm doing, sure but Tiberoa. it's doing it. What? I'm pretty sure that's Tiboroa, not Taboria. Tiboroa? Uh, Tibono. I can say it's it is my fault because people were wounded by someone they th by trusting someone they thought was me. Yeah, for sleeping too long. I am determined to make atonements for this, even if it takes forever. Right after mine. <laughs> yeah, right after I go back and uh, you know relax in my castle while you guys all are struggling on the street. I feel like they're struggling on the street. This town looks pretty good. I owe you a debt of gratitude. I love this country and I love you people. Okay, so you're right. In this particular town, they're all fine. But considering they have, they've had a bunch of bandit problems and all their other towns are kind of fucked up and people have been murdered. Um, <clears throat> yeah. I, ha I have a favor to ask you, Princess Emile. May I ask you to name my baby, my soon to be born baby, your highness? I have baby names for crying out loud. It would be my pleasure. What? What was that, Nate? I said buy a book of baby names. Why would you have someone else name your baby for you? Oh, it's the princess. It's royalty. Who cares? Look how, how horrible about she is at it. I? I.e. For, for a girl and L for a boy. I'm pretty sure that's Al. Yeah, I said Al. No, you didn't. I said, said Al for a... No, Al. 
I like I like the idea of the girl being called Aye. Aye and Ale. They have a sound of grace for Thank you very much, Your Highness. Those are not beautiful names. <coughs> no, they're not. I mean, but her name is Emily, spelled in the worst way possible. It, it is not Emil Emily. It's like Emil or Amelie or Emil. Nah, I'm certain it's Emily. Well, I'm the one speaking it, so I get to choose. Nah. Not how it works. Mm, oh, Princess Emily. Emil. How beautiful you she is. You literally said Emily. <laughs> I did, because you put that in my brain. <laughs> Because that's clearly what it is. Mm, just like I man imagined. Mm, oh, thank the Lord for leading me to the country of Princess Emile. How is it Emile? <laughs> There's no wrong? way that those letters make Emile. Imanamulu. It's whatever I want it to be. Oh, no. My Where is Peasles? Emile. 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 Yeah, you can meet her in the castle. You're a king. Just fucking walk up. <coughs> yes, I know you can. Just move the fuck out of the way. You don't have to tell me every time I come by. So big. He is a big boy. That's why they use him as a glorified door. Oh. <sighs> we have been waiting for you, sir. Please proceed to the chamber of the sun. And then you get fried by a giant magnifying glass. Bzzoo. Well, when two guards ran at me, I was expecting to have to fight again. I'm always down to, for some murder. We gonna murder them all. <clears throat> Hi, King. Uh, we failed. Sorry. How did we fail again? Heroes, forget the formality. You are special guests of Tiboria. Welcome back. I'm glad you're safe and sound. Oh. <coughs> so I was cleaning for a good chunk of today, and my throat is all fucked up from cleaning chemicals. This is going to go great. I feel like you're just trying to find an excuse before every stream to get away with having a bad voice. See, I don't mind the bad voices. It's the sticky coughing that's the problem. That was a that was a great crack. I think it was a coke. The sound of a soda, delicious. I almost got beer, but I decided a coke instead. <clears throat> my my sister is acting as if nothing happened, but until you came back, King Albert, she had lost her appetite completely. <clears throat> it's not only a meal. <clears throat> we were longing for all of you to come back. And we failed you, so you're not going to be longing for long. Well done. And un unfortunately, the moon dagger is still in their hands. We failed. We did not bring it back. Oh, stop it. You, you people brought justice upon the evil bandits. You yeah, defeated the sea afraid. dragon inf that infested Eliza Bay. It was you. Young people who brought peace and happiness to Taboria and brought smiles back to our people. I'm sorry, that is not, that does not say Taboria. Suck my Taborian dick. <laughs> I, I, your Tiboroan <laughs> dick? Mm, however, the moon dagger has to be passed down on to Princess Amelie. Amelie. Mm, the moon. Uh, oh, how do you, that's how not do you right say his name, accent. huh? Is that he's, king, he's King Zor. Zor? Where'd yeah. the eye go? <sighs> Suck it. The moon dagger is That's a mere royal went. tradition. Tradition alone doesn't put smiles on our people's faces. That is all the moon dagger can be. King Albert, we are satisfied with the way things turned out. You really, really shouldn't be. Instead of the moon dagger, we found something else to hand down. Friendship. Uh, well, she wants a little more than friendship with Albert. That is the his the oh, I can't say that oh word. Oh my goodness, that is the corniest thing I've had to write. The historic. The, I can't. Heroic. Holy shit. Tongue. You really, speak. You, 
You really can't uh, read. Why can't I say that in the voice? What is wrong with me? You're the illiterate. Story of oh, I forgot to put it on my, my VTube, dude. Wow, I am all over the place. Give me a moment. One moment. You're going to see some funky this. <coughs> Jeez Louise, I think this is the most harebrained stream I've done. Let's click on you. Make sure it clicks on. No, no, that one. The other guy is not ready yet. Okay. Yeah. Ugh. All right. I'll be back on when I get to the other the other house. Goodbye. <clears throat> the heroic story of you. It will be passed down through the ages from person to person. The seven stars arose from the east to save the country of the king who lives in the chamber of the sun. That sounds like a really flowery way to do it, and no one's going to know what you're talking about, even one generation down the line. <clears throat> That's enough for formality. We are having a banquet for you. Please enjoy yourself. A banquet? Is it a banquet? <sighs> He's a banquet, a party? Kevin, I, I, I need help, man. I don't know why, but I can't speak today at all. Plainly speaking, yes it is. Cool, it's a party, a party for us. Uh, Maru, behave and be quiet. <laughs> she is cheerful and excited. <coughs> We still have we still have time for the party. Please feel free to relax. Let us prepare a banquet. Mm. Oh. 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 Ah, uh, yeah, yeah. It seems we can relax for the first time in a long time. You could relax quite a few times. There's been some war, but it's fine. Yeah, everyone spread out now. Go away. Is that where Bart was born? I forgot. Uh, of course we'll be busy again. <coughs> I'll be walking around till the party starts. Yay. I get to run around and discuss with everyone before we get to continue, probably. <laughs> I've got an, er an errand to do. Oh, she's gone again. Mm, let me go to... Oh, fuck. It's darting Shana time. You have to appreciate what everyone did. Do I? Do I really? I don't want to appreciate it. Uh, okay, let me... I saw the save thing, so I'm doing a quick save. Save state. Oh, I almost fucked it that time. It would have been fitty, fitting to have fucked it, uh... Right when Nate leaves, so he misses me fucking the save. Yay. They get to get their feelings out in the... I'm not voicing all this. My throat is just dying. Yes, have your wholesome moment and so you, we can boot her off the edge and get her out of here. Yeah, 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 yeah. You were thinking about him every single day. Uh, I really hate these two's connection. <clears throat> oh, yay, they get to get their feelings out. Oh, that's not ominous and going to end up with one of them dead. Yeah, we'll get all this all out once one of them, once the journey's over. And fester the cock blocker. <laughs> Come on. What, what voice did I do for fester anyways? Anyway, you're famous in this city. I don't know. I'm doing new voices. The hero that defeated the dragon that descended down on Taboria. Eh, if you say so, it still doesn't feel like it's real. It's your modest attitude. You are a... You are our time's he latest hero. Well, I don't know why that sentence feels wrong to me. 
in. By the way, the party is starting. Get rid of the sour face and be happy. We'll see you later. I don't know why I went with that voice, but it just, it felt fine for the moment. I, I don't know. I don't know. Ah, no, no. All right. Back to trying to make a move. And next cock blocker. There we go. <laughs> oh, Mr. Darkness Shadow, why are you here? Uh, just, just waiting for the party to start. It's starting soon. Okay. Please get everyone or I cannot prepare the dress. Uh, I'll see you later. Okay. Do we have cock block part three? Nope. Never mind. We're just going to move on. Yep. Cool. Hopefully now we don't have to deal with that going forward all the damn time. I just do not care. Not in the slightest. Uh, I should check up the tower in case someone's up there. Because I don't know where everyone is. We're told we have to go look for people. Uh. Sorry, scratch my face. Let off the running button. Round and round and round we go. Where are we stopping? Nobody knows. Ah, uh -huh. a strong heart, a passionate eye, a fabulous man. Okay. <laughs> oh, oh, Dart, how long have you been there? How uh, may I help you? Yeah, we, we just need to get everyone together and go. Oh, okay. Never mind. I thought I was supposed to doctor. Apparently, I'm not. I was just uh, interrupting her. <sighs> Fantasizing about somebody. It's Heschel. It's probably Heschel. He's a kooky old man, but he's he's got that eye. A uh, smooth. Just making sure you know. You've been muted for a long time. All right, so he knows. That would that would explain a lot. Okay. <laughs> You've been muted since before Nate left. Yeah, I, I muted because I had a, a bit of a hacking fit. And ah, then, uh, yeah. I guess I just forgot. I, I was responding, but uh, clearly I forgot that I was muted. Uh, okay, I was like, I can't tell. I am a hero. He would left. You would laugh at me. <laughs> I don't know what I don't know. Dot 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 exclamation point question mark. What sound is that? Uh, I I laugh now. Yes, people laugh. Aha! It's a thing. I did laugh. No shit. Since I have started to wear this choker, I have not laughed for years. Okay. Apparently it was worth the wait. Great. We're coming in. Time to get going. I'm here to tell you the party's starting. You gotta go get changed. It'll be a it'll be a fun party. Ah, uh, maybe. I don't think it will. Oh, that's blocked off. Okay. We found one of our members. I, I, I wasn't actually paying attention when everyone else walked off, so I don't know where they went. Are you in here? Oh, Kongle's in here. Kongle. As. Friends. Friends of. Different species. Not bad. Ah! Don't do that. Congo no like. <laughs> That's what I should say. Did you hear Congo speaking? Mm, not really. By the way, the party is starting. Uh, 
Hmm. Cannot carry any more items. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna use two healing breezes. Because there's two boxes. Moon Serenade. And Sun Raspberry. Uh. The party is starting to find all of them. Okay. I'm missing two? No, three. Uh, all right. <coughs> Just a peek is fine. I want to see the party food. We are not going to eat now. Oh, no. We are not going to eat now. We just want to sample the food. That is eating. Please get out. You're delaying the preparation. Mr. Dark, please stop them. <laughs> Boss, never choose their time. You got to eat whenever you can. That's basic understanding for a warrior. You want to eat too, don't you, Dark? <coughs> no. Don't let me in with you two idiots. Why didn't you say so? That's literally why we're here. All right. Albert. I know where Albert is. Do you? Oh, yeah. He's having um, uh, a private meeting with a certain princess who is rather infatuated with him. And he seems to be rather infatuated with her. Uh, why would you want your room on the top of a tower like this? Like so many damn stairs. <coughs> Do you know about the legend of the mermaid? I've already forgotten what voice I did for her at the start of the stream. It's just... Uh, no, tell me about it. The king of some country is gazing out over the waves of the sea and thinking. His life is hollow, just like the vanishing bubbles. Everything looked like that because the king didn't know true love. Oh, we're going super cringy this episode, I see. Under the waves, a mermaid was thinking the same thing while gazing at the clouds in the sky. Oh my, what happened to the two of them? Wouldn't you like to know? <laughs> this is a secret story. It's handed down only within the Cerdo royal family, so I cannot tell you anymore. Oh, I'm so sorry, I can't go on. <coughs> oh, you are teasing me! <laughs> but I'm having a fabulous time. I didn't know the passing of the time when I'm talking with you. Kevin, I'm regretting Laud's stream today. <laughs> It has been a series of the cringiest conversations that I don't even want, you know, online. You don't, you don't even want, want to read it? I I do not. I, I refuse to read the Dart and Shannon time because I knew it was going to be bad. And then the other ones, I don't want to read it. I don't want voice clips of myself on this. Like, this is bad. This is like 90s D-tier romance movie bad. Ooh. The party is starting soon, so get your pants on and go downstairs. Nah. It's already that time. <coughs> Unfortunately, I have to leave you now. When can we meet again? Hmm. Uh, when the stars fill the sky. Albert, just say tonight. Seriously. Mm, when the stars... <laughs> okay, good. Thank you, Dart. Fucking call him out on that. <laughs> At the party. Uh, yep, that's everybody. Uh, uh, you know what? 
Jimmy Congo. I, I'm doing too many high voices lately. Ah, by the way, the dress is... Yes. We already saw her. She was next to where Congo was. Yes, I know I should be training Maru. I just don't want to trade Maru. Congo is too fucking OP. Actually, fuck it. I'm just going to swap out Rose for Maru because I know I'm going to need to deal with her soon. And if her addition is not up to snuff, I am going to be in pain. <clears throat> that is one of the kind of shitty things about the addition system. If you're not using them and training their addition, when they get to be the solo part of the story, oh, they are so worse. Like their levels are fine, but they have the shittiest additions, so they don't get SP. They don't do much damage. It's, it's just rough. You just play on Dark Souls difficulty for no reason. Yeah. And especially as the, we get later and later into the game, where the enemies become more and more cheesy, it's rough. It seems everyone is here. Miss Shanna, Miss Rose, Miss Maru, please come this way. You have to change into the... <coughs> Lightheaded from that coffin spree. You have to change into the dresses. Man, I'm coming down with something. I have to be. The last, like... Four days, I just suddenly got the littlest of coughs that have been pushing harder and harder on me. I don't know what it is. Yes, I am. Princess Emile and Princess Lisa insist. Good for you. <laughs> no, thanks. That's not like you. Because I'm a dancer. I can't dance where well in those dresses. Um, Ladies, just... Shut up and do it for one night. Realistically, you shouldn't be allowed your sword anywhere near the king, but that's a story from another time. Okay. Only one of them is even going to do it. Wow. <laughs> you know 100% they were going to have all three do it, but they were running low on time, and they're like, yeah, cut out the extra ones. Those are models we don't want to model. Especially because back in the, when they were making this, a model change was a whole new model. Like, there was almost zero reuse you could do. Yeah, I would imagine anything new <laughs> would just have to be completely uh, done done by scratch. Yeah, nowadays it's a lot easier. Back then yeah, it was you like... Just take no. an, old, an older asset and rip it. Well, it's not just that. When, nowadays when we make a new model, uh, we tend to have a whole body underneath. So you're literally just making clothing and rebind it. Okay. And then we just cut out the pieces that aren't going to be seen after the fact. So it makes the early stages so much easier. This is a banquet to honor the seven heroes who saved Taboria. Please enjoy yourselves to the utmost. Man, we look out of place. Mr. Dart, wait for us! Oh, lovely. He's getting mobbed. <laughs> Woman in red. Doesn't even get a name. You must be Mr. Dart. I am dying to hear your story. Oh, excuse me, but monopolizing him is not fair. Please let me hear your story, too. I'd like to know more about you. Oh, my. Don't be so fresh with him. Oh, my throat. I talked to him first. Oh. <laughs> oh, you must be Mr. Heschel. <laughs> I'll take care of things here. Why don't you go and enjoy yourself with Shanna? <laughs> At least tonight you have to make good use of the time you two are together. I, man, I could not do the Heschel voice there. It was murdering me. What, what did you do to Congo? What, what did you do to Shana? I didn't do anything. No Shana here. 
No? <coughs> Kongul tall. Kongul doesn't see from here. Yeah, we're we'll probably still getting changed. That shit takes time. Of course, Maru is a literal fucking child just sprinting back and forth in the middle of the ballroom. Are you enjoying yourself? Yup, it's fun. Are you going to dance too? Lord, no. No way. I was one of those assholes who stood at the back of the hall whenever you, or we were forced to dance in school. Don't say that. You're totally going to enjoy yourself tonight. No. <coughs> okay. Where is Shanna? I don't know. I've been here with you. <laughs> I've been like seven feet away. I'm surprised that Maru doesn't like toss your ass afterwards. Uh, and of course, Albert and the prince. Uh, you know, what? I'm not even going to talk to them. I'm just going to wander around. Oh, is there no, th there's literally no side exits. Uh, do I go this way? No, I'm not allowed to leave. I have no choice but to go talk to Albert. I really, really don't want to. Mm, and I have to go to Melesasu with Dart. I'll wait for you. I'll wait for you forever. <laughs> mm, Emil, well said. The future of Cerdo and Tabori is shining like the sun. Mm, I believe love is the only entity that never changes over time. And distance makes love grow deep. Jeez Louise. What is this fucking episode? Oh, I cannot watch anymore. Neither can I, King. Neither can I. What's wrong? You have a long face. <coughs> mm, if you're looking for Shanna, she's not here. No shit. Okay. I fucking checked. There's no door there. Miss Rose. That way. <laughs> Apparently I was just banned until I listened to the vomit worthy conversation from uh Albert. <laughs> Are we gonna get more vomit worthy conversation? Probably. Probably. Like, I'm okay with romance stuff, but this has been some of the worst romance stuff I've ever read. I forgot how bad it is. Hello, Nate. Hello. Uh, is there anything important? You missed some of the worst and cringiest romance dialogue I've ever I've ever had the mispleasure to reread. I forgot how bad it was. <laughs> so I what love you're saying this is game. I chose the best time to leave. <laughs> oh yeah, I love this game, but there was legitimately parts of it. I was like, I am not voicing this. I don't want voice lines out in the internet of this. This is, this is. The worst of 90s D-tier rom-com lines. <clears throat> Dart, why are you procrastinating like that? Do you want her to catch a cold or something? Okay. How the fuck was he supposed to know? And no one knew where she went, you dick! Ugh. She's over there. Oh, you mean if I had looked to my left instead of my right? Uh-huh. Oh, yay. More cringy dialogue. I I don't know if I want to read. I, I despise the Dart Shanna connection. So I'm not even going to voice these lines. Fuck you. If there was one part of this you, game. You don't get to be like that. You don't get to just choose you don't like part of the game. Oh, I absolutely do. I fucking despise. Buys Shanna Dark Connection. If I could change one thing about this game, I'd boot Shanna out of the game. She would have died with the hometown. She's a bland character, and there are so many more interesting characters. Uh, and uh, <coughs> she is like the bottom of D tier girl next door romance story. Like, of all of the questionable storytelling in this game which happens which i'll admit there, there, there is a fair bit of a hilariously bad stuff 
She is the worst part. I fucking hate her. I wonder if my wish will come true. Shut the fuck up. <coughs> uh, my wish won't. Are we going to get cock block number three? Oh, nope, nope, no cock block this time. You missed it. They did the, the stereotypical thing as they were getting closer earlier where people were just showing up at the right time to cock block. No, I don't want to save now. But I do want to save now. All right. <coughs> we have managed to beat disc two. Uh, nice. Nice. Load new Wonderful. disc. Three, four. Uh, disc two felt shorter than disc one. Uh, it might have been. It also might have been. We we did pretty good, and we kind of steamrolled through everything. Like, we had no problems. All right, I'm going to save again in the new disc. So who knows how long it's been? Since what? <clears throat> well, since our last scene. Because we were at the castle, but we're now on the boat. Which means at the very minimum, we spent some time at the castle. We left the castle, traveled back to the other town to get back on the boat to get onto the boat to, to boat over to this uh, Milisesu. Not sure. But we will never know. I'm right. trying to figure out how to cast this to that TV so I don't have to watch this on my phone. There's a smell of blood around this place, but it's not bad at all. See, my friends, that's what we would generally call in the business a red flag. What's it's that? been a long time. Uh, her saying there's a smell of blood, but it's not bad at all. Uh, I mean, who doesn't love the smell of blood? If if the lady you're with is really enjoying the smell of blood, either you share a kink or you need to run real far, real fast. <laughs> it's been a long time. Hmm. <laughs> Have you been here? Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. Well, I'm very popular. That's why. Oh, across sea, first time. Hmm. Fernie, the water city. This port is the front door of Melesesu. On our way, I wonder why Lloyd revealed his destination to us. Are we just putty in his hands? I still don't know. Whatever he wants, we'll murder him before he gets there. I agree. <coughs> For the sake of the victims hey, so far. Hey, I figured it out. It's not only that to prevent there being new victims. We have to stop the Lloyd. You figured it out. You got me on the big screen. I do. Yeah, I'm now on. Now I can just figure out how to make my phone full screen. And oh, look at that. Pa, I'm on the big screen. Yeah, you're on the big TV. The big TV. Mm -hmm. Oh, I'm behind the counter. <clears throat> because of the incidents, the sales of items has increased a lot. I don't know if I should be happy or sad. You're making money. You should be happy. Uh, will you not sell me items unless I'm on the water? Well, fuck you. He's biased against, against landbound people. Mm-hmm. Uh, he sells the semen only. <laughs> of course he does. Um, This building makes my head hurt. When I was a child, I saw really... 
I saw reality. That's reality, right? Yes. I feel like I'm having a stroke. I saw reality in fairy tales too. <laughs> Did we lose Kevin? Oh no, I shouldn't have read no, the I'm, tales. I'm, I'm I'm just here getting lost in this uh <laughs> lost in the next sauce. level next level dialogue. Oh no, I shouldn't have read the tales about fairies in the evergreen forest. Oh man, fairies in the evergreen forest? Whatever could that be in relation to? <coughs> Winglies? I said fairies, not winglies. You know winglies what? could be easily mistaken for fairies. There are fairies living in the forest. My story, my storybook says so. So I'm thirsty, and there's still coffee beside me from this morning. Don't drink it. Too late. It's it's seven forty, dude. Don't drink it. It's pretty good coffee. Oh, we got battle music going on. And a bunch of people who are obviously not, you know, unnamed NPCs about ready to get... What is that guy? I don't remember. Can you guys see my mouse? What the mm -hmm. he looks fuck like, is this guy? He looks like a troll with, like, <laughs> flowers growing on him. I don't remember him at all. I remember the rest of these fucks. I don't remember him at all. I don't think I could see him because my old TV was so fucking bad. Resident Knight of Harris. Okay, so he's gonna sound like this. This seems to be all of us. Now I'll explain the strategy. We have to overcome the white wolf called Kemu that lives in the evergreen forest between this village and Denigrad. Did you call us just for that? Not only that, a boy from the village, Tio, has disappeared in the evergreen forest. The strategy is simple. All of us will beat the bushes all over the evergreen forest. I promised a f I promised a five times larger prize for the one of you who defeats Kemu. I five promised the same for the one who saves Tio. He's gonna be me. I'm itching to do it. Who are you? Never seen you before. You look like you have a chance, but I'm getting the prize. Don't even disturb me. I thought this was about saving a kid, not rewards. Are you scared of your wits and cannot talk? <coughs> Cut it out. We have to cooperate or we cannot overcome Kamo. Come here, come on, Aro. Come Come see, come saw. Kamu Kamei. I'll let you know when we start. Until then, you have some free time. You are dismissed. Why wouldn't we start immediately? <coughs> People need to get potions and shit. There's a kid missing. People need to get potions and shit. I if mean, this is medieval times, so you expect to lose a few children, but... Look, if you fail to plan properly, you plan to fail. It's just the way it works. It's only one wolf. I'll shoot it with my arrow. Nah, he's gonna die. Uh, I'm not gonna say anything as to the fates of anyone. Sorry about They're all bogus. Gonna die. Everyone's feeling uptight before battle with the savage wolf. Please excuse them. No, no, no. I want to get on this. Give me that prize money. I'm almost certain that they're not even going to get a cutscene. They're going to die in, like, this world where we just see their, like, 3D model go flying after a, like, horribly animated polygonal wolf attacks them. See, Nate, that's not a hard guess considering the literally the only uh, cutscenes we've seen so far was Shanna's thing in the beginning and the dragon campaign. Literally nothing else gets a cutscene. Be careful moving on forward from your journey. Um. Oh, I, no, we've seen other cutscenes. Oh, which ones were cutscenes? When the Winglies were destroying that fortress or whatever. That's the dragon campaign. So that's a cutscene. Like I said, the only cutscenes we've ever seen are 
from the dragon campaign or Shanna being stolen. No one in modern era other than Shanna gets a cutscene. I think we're having a, a strange disagreement even though we're agreeing on what we're saying. I'm a little bit distracted. I'm trying to find my... It was Teal who brought the I injured need. wolf club. That wolf is coming, we're talking about... Oh, so it's Teal's friend. I wanted to go to the National Library in Denigrad. No, you can't. There's a man-eating wolf out there. Maybe a wolf eating man. Oh, how did I? I'll be right. Okay, whatever. I found it. I'll be right with you. Okay. Fuck you. Oh, wait, that's it. Okay. Here's the license for the boat. The mayor gave us an order to rent the uh, rent the boat to warriors for free. Yeah, fuck it. I'll take it. Well, you are the warriors who woke, who to overcome the wolf, aren't you? Uh, yeah. Yep. Yeah, sure. We'll definitely be that. Dude, I'm so hungry right now. You look fishy, though. No, just hungry. I cannot give it to you because there's something fishy about you. Well, fuck you. We're going to be the ones to do it because when, wherever we go, literally everyone is a buffoon and no one can do anything without us. We it's have to be like the ones that win. like a character in a PS1 game. I know, right? Mm. Oh. Welcome to Fernie! Ooh. This place is warm because of the warm current. But if you go inland, it becomes suddenly cold! Oh, Dart knows. Dart's been here before. If you visit the country, the royal capital, Denigrad, and the Crystal Palace are must sees Oh, yeah, something's going on with you. Guys, yeah, yeah. I found a bag of peanuts. Nice. Ah. I've got garlic ribs I'm slowly snacking on. Man, I wish I had some garlic ribs. They're fucking great. Overpriced as fuck, but great. So delicious, though. They are so delicious. I don't regret buying them. I will regret it tomorrow or probably tonight at about 3 a.m., though. So what kind of garlic ribs are we talking about? We're talking about, like, from an Asian restaurant? Yes. So, like, the breaded ones? The breaded ones. Oh, damn no it, I wish I had those. Those are so good! They're amazing. Uh, do you give me any more info? Can I? I'm gonna leave tomorrow. Okay. Ooh, I know Although what to do. salted peanuts are pretty good. Salted peanuts are great. I have um a bag of mixed nuts, which are peanuts, cashews, almonds, and something else. I can't remember. Can't eat them while I'm streaming because they're way too crunchy. Life is just a bowl of assorted cashews. I wish it was. It would make life much better. Um, hmm. You're not gonna. How do I progress? I'll be honest. I don't really like cashews that much. They're a little bit too. I don't know. They're like they're they're a nut that I can't eat a lot of. I think they're a <laughs> bit too like rich. Let's just say no. From Tamoria, with that huge boat. Yeah, uh, yeah. Yeah, it's the Queen's Fury. Well, one to wait a minute. One, two, three, seven. Could you be the famous dart and companions who conquered the sea dragon in Elizabeth? How the shit do you know about that? We are the I first motherfuckers you. to be boating over here. Word travels fast in medieval times. No, it doesn't. That's the whole thing. They didn't have proper communication. It took months, if not no, years. No, not true at all. In small towns and areas, like the castle is in this town. All of the guards live in this town. Not this town. Everybody we are in knows another everything. country, Nate. We are in another country that we just took a boat over to that's not even connected by yeah. land to the country we were just in. This is the third country. On? Did you come on a boat with a bunch of seamen and soldiers from the other country? We are the first motherfuckers off that boat. Mm-hmm. We watched the arm of the boat extend and land, and then our people started walking off first. Uh, it's a cutscene, <coughs> man. The other three people could have already gotten off. 
Bullshit. Here it is, the license boat. Take it. Okay. And yet, he knows already. Uh, it's bullshit. Lies and bullshit. Oh, you'll give me a good price. Let me let me go shop first, and then we will sleep for tomorrow. But I think that's how we uh, move on with the story. People gossip so much back then. Um, go to the front. Yes, they did, but it's physically impossible the gossip is spreading. Nah. People get off the boat. Talk in the tavern. <laughs> Physically impossible. Isn't that the boat store where you buy supplies? No. This is so the, the sailors shop. on the boat that dropped you off would have gone to talk to them? No, that's the guy who gives out licenses for the dinghies to go around town. I should He's make... probably good friends with people on the docks. <laughs> it's bullshit. You know what? Goodbye. <laughs> I'm gonna get rid of two recovery balls and just buy healing fog. There. Plus, you killed the sea dragon like a week ago in game time. It could be a week, could be a month, could be three years ago. Depends on how long the boat trip was. So there could have been lots of time for a word to, pa to travel. I just feel like it's bullshit. I, I don't I don't see it. It's insane. No, a dragon being defeated is a huge thing. Yeah. And I will also say, well, to your point, it's also not the first dragon we've beaten publicly at this point. Mm -hmm. So it would be a topic of conversation. Especially since dragons were thought extinct for the last 11,000 years. Mm-hmm. I think more people wouldn't believe it, though. Yeah, but it would be coming from people coming off of ships as well as soldiers and people on travel, right? You uh, hear enough about it. I guess. I don't know. Ooh, Giganto Ham. Why in the world would they be stocking a helmet specifically for the last Giganto? Uh, because they raided uh, the Giganto's home for trinkets and found it. Oh, hell. You oh, that attack boosts. Kongo's going to fuck them up. <laughs> That's a pretty big uh, boost. 20 21. Points. Yeah. 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 Well, let's talk to the fisherman. Hey, fisherman. Catch any fish, man? Are you the heroes from tomorrow? It seems there's no need for you to show up. Uh, well, fuck you, too. That was a weird thing to say. Right, we'll go to the right. Also, that fish sign looks like the mouth of a face. Kinda. Let's go to the upper right. I wonder if these guys have the Venice issue. Hey, it's the mm -hmm. Grumbly Bastard. Let's go talk to Grumbly Bastard. Hey, Grumbly. Sorry, but this road is closed. Take another road. Oh, fuck you, Grumbly. Why is he Grumbly? Because he was grumbling at us before? No, damn it! Uh, That's not front! That was backwards! <laughs> Alright, well, we gotta go back there. Uh, right. Can he mess it up a second time? Oh, I can, but I hopefully won't. Mm. To the Mayora's house. Are they coming yet? The heroes from Tabora.
Something I've just noticed. I have been very hard trying to make sure I'm not giving anyone any stereotypical accents. I should stop that and give people some really funny, dumb accents. <laughs> oh, I couldn't sit, uh, sit still. I was just pacing around waiting for you. The story of your heroic deeds in Deborah has reached us here in Fernie. That would mean you'd have to have the skill to use an accent other than your own. I should develop that. It is wonderful what you did. And now I would like you to listen to my story. Okay. Uh, yeah. From the beginning, please. I would like to talk to you briefly about the sad situation in this village. Everyone would you pretty please happy. listen to me? Nah. I'm saying okay, fuck Sorry, you. Sorry, we have no to- uh. I want to continue the story. This is my daughter, Fa. Wow. Just father of the year, naming his kid Fa. The scales. More like, what the fuck? So his first child is so Fa Latido. Oh. Ha, 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 ha. A few days ago, my daughter was attacked by a wolf. Fortunately, the injury was not bad. However, since then, Ow. she hasn't talked at all. Probably from the How shock the of the incident. She's a child and she was attacked by a wolf. Yeah. But here's the thing. No one saw it happen and she won't talk. Oh, poor thing. The wolf is becoming more savage every day. Now he's even been joined by a monsters from the evergreen forest. And now they attack people. Mm, I see the warriors outside of the group headed for battle. Indeed, if we finish off the wolf, your daughter may become better. That's not how that works at all. Nope. <laughs> but it is more complicated than that. The wolf called Kemu that attacked Fa was kept by a boy of this village. Until recently. And the boy who kept Kemu was named Theo and disappeared. On the night Fa was injured, Tio disappeared from his home. Probably he feels responsible and ran away. Nah, so there's some bullshittery that the mayor's covering up. Tio has been Fa's friend since they were little. They were best friends. <sighs> and you want us to cooperate with you in this mission? Yes, of course I cannot force you. Now we have a lot of warriors. Maybe they are enough. Nah, eh, there won't be. Oh, sorry about this. I have made you listen for such a long time without thinking about you at all. Well, as my apology, won't you stay at my house for the night? It will be an honor to entertain the heroes. Well, we do need a spot for the night, and I am a cheap bastard and don't want to have to pay for it. Do you, so like do you think Hannah? that the kid Tio turns into the wolf? Um, no, because they said that the kid was raising the wolf, so they've both been seen at the same time. This no, is not a Clark kept, Kent Superman said, thing. No, no, no. It said he kept the wolf. It never said that they were seen together. He kept the wolf. The boy was from this village. He kept the wolf in this village. He <laughs> kept him out near the woods. I, I, no, I, no, no. I'm glad mm -hmm, Fa mm -hmm. is happy too. She is lonely since her mother passed away. Now let me see. When you're ready, to say yeah, 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 yeah. I'm just gonna hit ready because we're ready. We've already been everywhere. Are you ready? Yes, yes, we are. Please, for the love of all that is good and holy, let me get back to gameplay. I want to murder some <laughs> things. It's been an it's been hour of talking. It's been a while since we got to fight something. Yeah. Yes, dear. Are you sleepy? Okay. A little weird, but okay. Why would you want warmth? It's a warm climate. Climate. They specifically talked about that in the town. <coughs> what? Something. Man, your audio is real poo right now. Why is Heschel staring? Because I'm using headset. That sucks. 
Hmm, this Yeah, I know. <laughs> this lullaby. Oh, Heschel recognizes the lullaby that um Shana is singing. Go, Heschel. Do something. Isn't it a lovely tune? This tune is a lullaby that I'm dedicating to my future baby. <clears throat> that, might, that might be better for her than mastering martial arts. Oh, the one time Heschel was a decent dad and not a piece of shit. What are you talking about? His daughter literally murdered somebody. And? That just doesn't a make murder. him a piece of shit. It's just a little murder. No. Banishing her made him a good father. He should have turned her over to the authorities. Nate, we gallivant across multiple countrysides, murdering people left, right, and center. It's just a little murder. No, no, no. We are fighting a war against people that the king has empowered us to murder. It's not legally murder, even if it is factually murder. Hmm. Yes, so I see no problems here. Big difference between what happened with Herschel's daughter. Ooh, heart. Mm. Dart do this to him? I lost his voice there so hard. He said his late mother sang to him, it's a special lullaby for Dart. <laughs> what? <laughs> I see. It was not a coincidence at all for me to be here. They're not going to imply that Dart is like Herschel's grandson. Correct. <laughs> Oh, Dart is, is Herschel's grandson. And neither of them realized it. Yeah, and his mom's dead. Yes. We saw them get murdered earlier on. Mm-hmm. So now Herschel just found out the whole reason for searching for her is not going to happen. Is she dead dead? <clears throat> it's a tune from my memory. Is it? <coughs> oh, my lungs are not happy with me. Do you do you remember when you first came to sales? I heard you stopped snorting cleaning supplies. Yeah, well, shit, I gotta clean. I was little when you used to sing the song to me. I remember that. Back then, I used to take care of you as you were my real baby sister. And now it's an Al uh, Alba Albamian? Fuck it. Al jo what? Now it's more like an Al Alabama? Man, am I having a Alabama? stroke? Alabama? That's the word. I think I'm having Are a you stroke okay? today. I don't think you I am. Try lifting your arms up and seeing if one is drooping. Both work. <laughs> but my brain, my brain no good. Your brain is drooping. My, my brain don't brain today, no, no brain. And I even slept good last night. I slept like a full eight hours. <laughs> what the fuck is wrong with me? Holy shit. Their relationship is turning into the one from, uh, what was that movie? Afro Samurai? I, I don't remember Afro Samurai. It's been too long. Uh, there's like this girl that grew up with him in the orphanage that was like his sister and he bangs her halfway through the movie. Oh, well, that's essentially what the cut to black we already had was them doing. Yeah. Childhood friend, wonder how... <laughs> the moon that never sets. I, I don't think it. moons ever set. Some sometimes moons go past the horizon. I had yeah, but I don't this. think it's called the moon setting. I I don't know. This moon literally is like geo locked, so it never moves at all. I didn't notice, it but the moon itself sense. has been involving itself in our journey. I don't think it has. Oh, everything's getting bright. Oh. Shana and her dragoon are doing weird things. <laughs> I mean, just explodes. Kabam! I'd be okay with that. Yeah, I bet you would. 
Oh. Apparently she needs to get out uh, of the moonlight. Something weird is going on with Shauna and the moon daggers and the moon pendants and the moon. You might the even moon. think you might even think she has a connection to the moon. Behold the moon. You can stay here forever? That is you, vaguely threatening. You should not be saying that to a young lass. Are you really okay? You can stay here, you can stay here forever if you like. If you <laughs> like. Yeah, that's uh, thank real you very creepy. much, but I really have to go. Yeah, no kidding. Uh, I'll see you, uh, hopefully never, because holy shit, I'm out of here. Let's go. We have to find Lloyd. We need to move on. Let's go. This man is clearly a freak. I am with you on that. Let's get the fuck out of here. Red in place. Fucking cheese it. <laughs> Ask him what his favorite movie is. Mm -mm. Don't. <laughs> You're not going to like the answer. It's going to be something like freaking Human Centipede. <laughs> yeah. Man, that song is hilarious. <laughs> what song? <laughs> Red Flags. I don't know what you're talking you, about. You literally referenced it. No. There's a song called Red Flags when he's going on a date and he asks her what her favorite movie is and she says Human Centipede. You literally referenced the song. I don't know what song you're talking about. I was referencing it just because it's a creepy movie that someone's saying you could stay forever would like. You are trolling me right now. I am legitimately confused. You are trolling the shit out of me. There is no way you do not know the song I'm referring to when you purposefully referenced it when I said Red Flags. I, I did not purposely reference it when you said Red Flags. I'm super You are confused. full of shit. I, I, Don't you start freaking gaslighting <laughs> me too, Kevin. I know I, you've seen it because I showed it to you. Showed what? I showed to the video at my house. Don't you start with me. What video? The Red Flags music video. Look, I, I, I get there's kind of a bit going on. I'm really confused right now. I don't know what you're talking no, about. No, you might not be gaslighting me, but Kevin 100% is. Okay, because I'm definitely I not gaslighting you. At my house. Here's the thing. Granny bells. What, you're talking about this thing, and I vaguely remember some like YouTube shorts with someone winking at the camera, but I don't actually know what that was. Other than yeah, the, oh, like that from one the song, he okay. says well, I'm, he's blinking at the waiter in Morse code. Oh, that video, the thing yes, you showed me like video. a month ago. Oh, uh, yeah, it's not like it goes away. <laughs> it I leaves my brain remember. pretty quick. <laughs> yeah. Oh fuck, magic! No. Why are you blinking so much? I have something in my eye. Nate, you're gonna have to send me this the video after this because I don't know what you're talking I, about. I I I, I will. No, the, whole really video, the whole point of the video is that her favorite movie is Human Centipede, so he's afraid she's going to murder him after the date's over. Look, if her favorite movie that's is a in red fact flag. okay, if her movie is in fact Human Centipede, that is a very legitimate worry he should have. Yeah, because he says unironically. That's part of the lines. It's like my favorite movie is Human Centipede. Unironically. <laughs> Jeez Louise. Yes, that's a very much a red flag. <laughs> she said the costume design was the highlight. Oh no. <laughs> it's a great song. I'll show you after. It's so funny. <laughs> the, the costume design is in fact something. Pursue. I try to get the waiter's attention by blinking in Morse code. Huh. Level up. Uh, okay, I'm actually gonna need to spend a little bit of healing on Mr. Congo. Because he got. Uh, where is he? Oh, uh, a little fucked up there. I watch a lot of animated music videos. 
save state. Okay, we're good. We're I thought right. you messed it up for a second there. Uh, look, if we if we had messed it up for a second there, we would have gone all the way back to the beginning of the disc. My reaction would have been a lot more than what it was. Oh, I mean, at least the we're at the very beginning of a new disc, so it's not as bad. Yes. No, no, it's just an hour of exposition. That I would be hammering the A button through as fast as humanly fucking possible. Yeah, yeah. Plus, he'd have to do it off stream, so we'd be fine. Oh no, I, I I would just continue the stream. It would just be we'd be redoing shit as fast as possible right here, right now. You think I'm gonna suffer alone? Hell no. Uh, I'm getting <laughs> kind of late. I gotta go to bed. Fuck you! It's eight. You got an hour. Nah, my bedtime's eight o'clock. Ah. Uh... So tired. Man, that's just a murder. I you fuck. really like the Starship Velociraptor. That is a great music video. It is a good one. <laughs> My favorite, though, is the Army of Tigers. Yeah. Uh, I don't that, like that one as much. That is a certified bop. It, it, it's a bop, and the music video is amazing. To be fair, I haven't watched it in a long time, but I remember not liking it nearly as much as, like, Starship Velociraptor. You just don't like it because even the other army one. of tigers to fight the sun. Yeah. What magic do you There was another one where they're on, like, a pirate ship, and I remember liking that one a lot, too. Oh, oh yep, that was Magic cannons. cannons, wasn't it? Yeah, yep. I liked that one. Fuck! Ooh, 84, not great. Not great. Uh, Storm the Castle was alright too. It's decent. I found the music video yeah. to be really weird. It is a bit strange. Did not see the pig coming in that one at all. Yeah, it's a bit it's a bit odd. It's not bad. It's fine. It's fine. It was just it's very unexpected. It's, it's a bit weird that the like random civilian somehow like a uh, top class fighter all of a sudden with no fucking that legs that, that is how animes work though to be fair that's true like randomly the blacksmith will be like a hell of a fighter for no apparent reason that is very fair it's one of the things i like, like about this oh, game no. yeah uh everyone has a reason to be a good fighter except for shana and thus, everyone is a good fighter, except for Shanna. That's one of the things that always drove me crazy in, like, animes, where it's like, we're being attacked by the soldiers, you know, the people who are trained to fight a war. But I am this normal civilian who is, for story reasons, OP as fuck. Oh, hi, Wolfie boy. Man, that wolf has cheeks. <laughs> Excuse me? Can you look at it? It's got cake for He's days. He's got cake! He's got cake for uh, days! He's got a giant red arrow pointing at said cake. I don't think that's what that is. <laughs> that's his upper hips, also known as his glutes, also at his cake. Are you sure he has something on his back? Uh, his back is in front of that. There is a very obviously li obvious line of delineation. I'll get him and I'll get the five times larger prize. Let me kill it. Stop it! Theo, you all right? Everybody listen, it was not Kaboo's fault. It was a different monster that attacked Fa. Theo, leave Kaboo. No way, because Kaboo's protected Fa. So I'll protect Kaboo this time. Please don't kill Kaboo. Theo, this is no longer the Kamu you knew. Many people were attacked by it. Guys, let's grab Teo first. Kidnapping, yay! It's not really kidnapping. All right, my wolf. Yeah. Hey, now it's kidnapping. Teo, I was about to say them. that was kidnapping. Okay, well, you presume that way. <coughs> the wolf called Kamu. They, they used to be Tio's. I wonder if why it became savage. It didn't become savage. We just, we literally just witnessed it not being savage. You know what? I'm going to go up this way. I'm curious as what's up here. If there's a treasure chest back there. 
There is. I, I noticed that. Whoa. First person camera. That's not first oh, person. That's just a wall. You're right. As I was saying it, my brain was like, no, it's not first person. We're going to continue the thought. There is no abort on this train. I do like how this uh, series has really shown how there is no buffer in my brain. Things instantly happen and I have no control over it. It's shown us a few things about you that uh, <laughs> I suspected but didn't know until now. Like, when other people read, I've heard it as like they read it, they think it, and then they speak it. Nah. My mouth is running as fast as my eyeballs are processing, if not faster. You're trying to anticipate what the next word is before reading it? Yep, pretty much. And my mouth is, is, is saying what was anticipated, whether it's true or not. Oh look, it's a dark elf, and we're just gonna violently murder them for no reason. Eat a dick, you humanoid bitch. Plant lovers. Ooh, wow, tiss, that, tiss. that drow just got... Ugh. Yeah. That'll teach him for being a peaceful creature living in his own home near me. That'll teach him for existing. That's right, you exist within 100 kilometers of me and you're gonna die. Oh, come on! It's kind of like if Will finds a spider in his apartment, it's over. You, That's right. You, you came You came within after, the vicinity. After he finishes tower. Here's the thing. The spider can exist as long as I don't see it. If I see it, it dies. People Fine. who saw our stream of Labyrinthine know how he reacts to spiders. They, yeah, that, that's a huge unkillable spider though uh, uh kevin unfortunately my reaction in real life to small ones is not that dissimilar <laughs> oh it takes boy. a lot for me to deal with them yeah i guess the phobia is real oh yeah <laughs> i still remember when i was growing up and i woke up in the middle of the night with a big sucker on my fucking knee I could not sleep and in my bedroom for days. I know uh, I would. I slept in the living room, holding on to one of the cats for the next couple days. <laughs> and that's why canonically he only has one leg. Remember that. I was like, all right, I sacrificed the leg. Yep. Sorry, leg. Worthwhile sacrifice. I was just. I have enough items for now. That's why his eraser doesn't have. His leg's visible, so you won't see that he's missing one. Uh, no, but okay. All of those cartoons that I have made of the Viking having two legs just to make him feel better. Well, actually, From he doesn't have on, legs. He has two feet, but no, but no legs. No, he has legs. But no, from now no on, legs. but from now on, I will make it canonical to how he is in real life with only the one leg. See, Nate, I can't wait until you see my next uh, model. As uh, I've been working on something. And uh, You already showed me that Viking you were making. Is it that one? I don't think so. You showed me a really detailed Viking model you were making. Okay, no, this, this is not that one. That one is uh, in limbo for pretty much ever at this point. I have a better one. And I even got it into uh, engine and was testing it. So it's functional. I just need to do an actual good job on the rigging. Because currently it's a wee bit poo for testing. And heck, if people were uh, paying attention, uh, when I turned on my little dude at the beginning, there was a few frames with it visible. Really fucked up, but visible. Oh, was it now? It was. Now I just gotta remember to what edit that saying? out of the YouTube video. Madness Hero! Eh, a simple pursuit. Fuck, I love Congo. He's so beastly. I love the fact we're back in combat again. Yeah, same. I am enjoying actually doing stuff. 
Maru, I need you to have much, much better additions sooner than later, please. As I am worried about the upcoming uh, story parts with her. Well, that's why you're using her now, right? To upgrade her uh, yes. additions or whatever. Yup. Get her some proper battle experience so she can do real amounts of damage. Damn, she's acrobatic. <laughs> but only in the Dragoon form. In her base form, she's oddly uh, awkward. I wonder why. Because she's a, a fish person. She's a fish person? Damn. Yep. Yep. I didn't know she's there were... She's a fish out of Woda. Uh... I've got enough items. I'm not wasting healing items for what is essentially going to be worse than a healing item. You're only streaming on Twitch now, right? Not, not Twitch and uh, YouTube anymore? For the moment. I, I'll eventually I'll get back to streaming on YouTube. It's just a colossal pain in the tuchus before stream. Because I have to do this whole ass setup to be able to uh, get a new stream uh, code and key every fucking time I want to stream. Yeah, definitely did not make make it easy. No. And as it is lately, uh, I've been rushing to get everything done before stream as is. So adding that on top, I, I would just never stream on time. Would not be good. But eventually, eventually I'll, I'll get back to it. It's just not a priority at the moment. Maybe, maybe they went this way. No, they did not go this way. Where did Wolf Boy go? Man, there's a lot of, uh, Battle moments. I do not like the snot trees. If you're snot, a psych color, call a doctor. Why? That is not a natural color. It's green. Snot is green. It's a snot tree. No. No, it isn't. Yeah, it's true. Your snot should not be green. What is wrong with you? Eh, generally, it's a bit green and a bit red. Red? Uh, red? That's very common. Uh, no, it isn't. It's the green, green I, the green I could kind of like let slide by. The red, no. Oh. very common for me. <laughs> That's a problem. I have very dry noses, so it's it's normal. The green is already a problem. It should not be, especially that green. This is a little bit more neon than normal, but not that weird. Yes. <laughs> nah. Hero. Madness. Hero. And bitch slap. Fuck you. Yes. Fuck. So bad at her addition. You're just bad at addition in general. Um, yeah. No, no, I've got addition generally down. Multiplication I suck at, though. Hey, Heschel leveled up. Uh, maybe this way? No, that's back to town. You know what? Actually, I'm going to go back to town and heal. And then we'll continue hunting for the big bad wolf. Wherever he might have gone. Uh, then we need to go this way. We need to go uh, front, which is not front, it's back. And then I think it's here, it'll be like to the inn or not. Uh, hotel. I find it really weird that you don't get health back at the clinic. You only get rid of debuffs at the clinic. You have to go to the hotel to get your health 
your HP points back. You have to go for a long rest, man. Short rest only lets you do health uh, hit dice. Yes. The clinic is healing ailments, not like fatigue. Yes, that's that, Kevin's more accurate. Yeah. It gets rid of ailments, poisons, and disease. It will not help you go sleep. Sleep. Well, they give you enough sleeping pills. Uh, upper right. Uh, if they give you any sleeping pills, it might, but they don't. Melatonin. Mm. So anything new or fun been up for you boys? Uh, I told you I ordered the FPGA Game Boy. Sure. The Game Boy Color Kit to make an FPGA console. Ah, yes, 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 yes. The no-cut yeah, console. I ordered one of those. Mm-hmm. Nice. Waiting nice. for that to come in. See how well that works, if it works as well as uh, people have been saying that pretty big win for the retro uh, retro community who want to be able to play their physical media. Um, hmm, I'm really confused now. Fuck it, I'll use an item. As you know, I really like physical media. I really dislike this whole move towards digital. Yeah. Especially with, like, that game developer said that people need to get used to not owning their games. There's some dumbass developers always. Someone's got to stick their foot in their mouth. Such a dumb thing to say. The problem is people keep supporting them even when they say stupid shit like that. Yeah, to stop uh, The majority them. of the internet said if I don't get to, if I don't own what I pay for, then why should I pay for it? They've said that, but have they acted on it? You need to actually act on it. They need uh, yes, to not buy it. is at an all-time high. Good. Teach them what's wrong. I don't know. I don't support pirating either. I, I think you should just own what you pay for. I support pirating if people do not make it easy enough to get. How did that miss? Well, if, if a game is... 30 years old and you can no longer buy it at a retailer. Oh yeah, that that's obvious. At that point, I don't even count that as pirating. That's just the only way to acquire something. But yeah, for me with modern games, if you don't make things uh, affordable or easy to get, then you've failed and you're gonna pay for it. I feel no sympathy to the business. The truth She's is, hammer smack. she does like to do her little hammer smack. Because I found out that it, so it sounds like the newest Xbox, the next gen one that's coming out, probably will not have a disk drive. That's not surprising at all. They've been trying to get away from disk drives for a while. No, Microsoft uh, was the only one that didn't. They were like the ones who were holding on to a disk drive, and that's why people like the Xbox. Because the Xbox has always been backwards compatible, and it always had a disk drive. Yeah. If they get rid of that, there's not really a reason to get an Xbox anymore. Well, that's the thing. Re one of the big reasons why Xbox has essentially been bowing out of the market for a little while. They're on the verge mm -hmm. of the, everything. Like there is no Xbox exclusive anymore. It's now Xbox and PC exclusive. Like. Well, yeah, but that's because Xbox is owned by Microsoft. Well, and that's so the thing is Microsoft sense. is pushing them further and further away from Xbox. Like they're they're no. probably going to still sell Xboxes for a while, but realistically, they're they're pushing PC no, direction. They 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 talked about it. They're not planning on scrapping consoles anytime soon. Uh, it's it's just that they're moving more towards Game Pass as their business model, not like exclusive games as much as like. They launched first on Game Pass. Yeah. I can definitely see that. Because, like, Game Pass is, like, 20 bucks a month in Canada. Yep. 
And, I mean, with how expensive AAA titles are, that's not really that bad. It's not. There was a time when I even paid for it. I don't anymore, but I did for a while. And uh, I did watch someone talking about, well, is it worth it to get an Xbox, the, the current gen? And it's like, an Xbox X? Not really, but an S is probably the cheapest way to play modern AAA titles. Yeah, it makes sense. Because the S is like oh, no. 250 bucks on sale. Yeah. But again, it's digital only as well. Because <laughs> it's the like mini version. Yeah. That's part of why it's cheaper. It's got less hardware. Yeah. Yeah, I'm not surprised. I, I have not bought a new console since the PS4, really. So I don't know. Uh, the newest console I own is the Switch. I don't really count the Switch because it doesn't really stand up to the other ones. It's still a console. It sure as fuck ain't a Game Boy. No, I... Well, I kind of disagree. Because I have the Switch Lite and it is essentially just a Game Boy. Yeah, I have the normal Switch. It's not a Game Boy. No, it's... I have both. It, it kind of is... It's a Game Boy that I can plug into my TV. It doesn't play AAA titles, really. It doesn't, but it's also not Game Boy titles. It's in the awkward middle stage. Yeah, which is why I don't really count it on the same level as a PS5 or an Xbox X. It's just too far behind in its capabilities. And yet, of the three of them, it's the one I'd want the most if I could only have one. It is I the only it. one I own. So, hey. I also have two. A little weird. Well, no, because I have one plugged into my TV, which is the original Switch. And then I have the Switch Lite as the one I actually play on. Little weird. I just find the Switch Lite to be a much more enjoyable... Uh, portable than the original Switch. That's fair. It's lighter. The D-pads don't like randomly disconnect or get knocked off their rails. As a slightly nicer form factor for playing. I, I just like it better as a portable console. Honestly, if there was more games on there that I actually wanted to play, I would 100% agree. Because I don't like using my Switch in dock mode. I've actually disassembled my dock to remove the cable from it so I can just charge it randomly because I, I don't use the dock. I don't like the dock. I like the dock for, like, because we've used our Switch to play multiplayer games with people when they come over for, like, a party. Yeah, no, that's So fair. the dock is great. We can play, especially with the Nintendo Live service now where you've got the old Nintendo 64 games and stuff. That works multiplayer. I absolutely so you can agree. play Mario Party plugged into the Switch, which is great. I, I I completely agree. It's just I don't have people come over to my house ever. Yeah, so yeah. There's no point in it for me. Man, I need to get an item to increase Kongle's speed. He only attacks once every like five turns. But when he attacks, you feel it. Juiced. He is juiced. I can't that wait does not get... look like a lot of damage, though. One ninety four. Oh, uh, that was one hundred percent of their f the le leftover X uh, HP. Mm. You you can't stack overflow the damage. Mm. Oh, Rose is behind. Why? Sup? And then you just spew out your entire party. Please go ahead. Uh. I remember I have some important errand to do. Okay, bye, bitch. I'll catch up with you soon. Look for Lloyd and Lloyd in the meantime. Well then. Hmm. She's mysterious, as always.
It's funny we should be talking about this because I was just thinking about like the loss of the handheld. Maru. <laughs> I remember I have an errand too. Nah, bitch. How rude. I'm just visiting my parents. That's all. Hmm, that's all. You should have said so. I'll miss you, Maru. <laughs> Sniff. I'll be back soon. No, you won't. See ya. Is that typical of Maru? I don't think so. Son of a bitch. Oh, wait. No, I still have Kongle. Never mind. I was like, oh, fuck. I'm going to have to have Heschel and uh, Albert. Kongle just didn't come out because he did not give a shit. Thank fuck. <laughs> Even though we right have way. more hands, we have so many more handhelds now than we have in the past little while. None of them feel like handhelds besides the Switch Lite. That's because they don't make handheld games anymore. I mean, like, technically the Steam Deck, the ROG Ally are handhelds, but they don't really feel like them to me. They do not. <laughs> um, And then you've got, like, the PS5 Companion, which I don't understand why you would ever buy. Uh, it's, it's essentially for people, essentially it's for kids who get booted off the TV if they want to still play while they're in the room. So, rich kids. Alright, so, uh... I should not have gone down that path before fighting the wolf. Eshel, you getting fucked up. <laughs> Madness Hero! Oh, yeah. You're so good at this. Oh, I'm I am great at this. I can see that. Good. You got eyeballs then. Yeah, I can see how good you are. Glorious. I'm the best there is. No one's ever been better. <laughs> yeah, for sure. At least I'm doing one of them. Ironically, it's the hardest of the three, and I can do it just fine, but the other two, nah. Man, we are getting just I mean, uh, I'm going to go back to making fun of you in a second, but that is usually how it works. When Fuck. you get good at the hard ones, the easy ones become more difficult because you hit the, the button too quickly. That's what I've been but doing in your with case, special. it's just because you suck. You can actually tell by the color of the uh, the square in the circle when I hit it, It'll just, whether it's too early or not. I should just, just heal. You need, you need help. And stop being bitch slapped. Mm. Menacing. Oh no. Ah, oh, come on. Now you've got a debuff. That's awful. Oh fuck. That was an O. I did not hit O. I hit X. You failed that real hard. Also, uh, Heschel has a different addition than I remember. I thought he was still on Double Punch. But that was definitely not Double Punch. Fuck. Now, you know what really sucks? Rose and Maru are losing uh, out on XP. You have to do another part with them alone soon. Uh, I know that we have a part with uh, Maru. That's going to be important. Um, I'm, uh, I'm just going to quickly save before we do this. Wrong button. Wrong button. No, I, I did it right. Um, fuck it. We advance. Uh, we, we've got a story part with Maru coming up, but it's going to be a whole thing. Go home. Demu's not bad. Go home. We met Fa. Fa's worried about you. 
close. It's true, Fa doesn't talk anymore since you disappeared. It's all your fault. It's because she really cares about you. Fa cares so much about me? She needs you. But... What about Kamu? He's gonna be killed if I don't protect him. That's right. <laughs> I'm gonna murder that dog. You pretended not to be interested, but you came back for the prize, right? <laughs> I wanna murder that dog. I won't let you. I'll finish the beast. Theo, come here. It's too late for Kamu. Don't come here. Uh. <laughs> Help! Uh. Bulgus. His name is Bulgus. Yeah, it's, it's Bulgus. Ah! Stop it! All right, Doggo. Time for you to die. Well, it's, it's probably time for us to die because I didn't heal before going into this like an idiot. Why is there a tree behind him? Oh no! Why is he suddenly so much smaller? In and out of combat scaling, we know this is uh, not the greatest. Go, Dragoon! <laughs> Time to murder this dog. Remember, murder one dog and you're a dog murderer for life. It isn't a dog. It's a wolf. It's just a dog's ancestor. I'm just gonna use melee attack. That's a decent damage. All right, Ashel, you time time for you to do. I forgot how extra his transform was. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Alright. Atomic Bind! Oh, man. I don't want to go to work tomorrow. Join the club. We have shirts. Yeah, but we're in the middle of a deadline, so I want to be working real, real stressed. Atomic Mine! And back to normal form, form you go. And bite! Ouch. You know what? I'll wait till it's Seshul's turn. Pursue! Uh, you still, you know what? Fuck it. You get a final burst. Final burst. I like when his wings go actual fire. Final burst. Man, I always love these attack where it's like, yeah, this is a single attack. That should hit like seven people. What the fuck are you talking about? Ooh, 495. Not bad. All right, Hatchel, uh. But not good enough. Do a quick healing breeze. I really should buy some mind purifiers. Okay. Oh! 646 damage to Kongle. You know what, Heschel? You can, you can do another healing breeze, because holy shit. That was some uh, chunky deeps. 
All right, final burst again. Use all your mana. I got mana items, so I should be okay if we have to fight another boss after this. You know how it goes. So, any plans for tomorrow's stream? Anything you guys want to play? Uh, I haven't thought anything yet. Oh, you're still going to be away from your PC, aren't you? Yep. yep. So mm. the two of you could think of something to play. Yeah. Can do whatever. I'm down for whatever. I don't, I don't think I can come up with another game like... Uh, the home line, safety, whatever. That was a fun one, but uh, yeah, those are going to be rare. Yeah, I don't think I have any more of those in my back pocket. Fuck. I'll think about it and see. Yeah. <laughs> Honestly, I could would love play to one of those. <laughs> could play one of those really old point and click adventure no. games. No. <laughs> Just no. One of uh, those. Do you remember those look and find ones? No, I don't. Uh, when we used to go to, like, uh, Bianca's Liquidation Center, they had all those old PC games, like the Haunted Carnival or whatever. Uh, we got a couple of them. All they ever were were these, like, point-and-click adventure games where you'd have to do look-and-finds for stuff, like, as one of the puzzles that you'd always run into. Fuck! Uh, yeah, I have no idea what you're talking about. I don't remember them at all. Oh, he's gonna hurt. Uh, the, it's a very popular genre of PC games that came out in like the early to late-ish 2010s. Interesting. Uh, the Game Grumps have about 40 episodes of them playing them. You have to send one to me so I can take a look and see. It's, it's a point and click. If you don't like point and clicks, you'd hate it. Here's the thing. Here's the thing. Yes, I'm going to hate every minute of it, but I might do some funny voices so it could be worth it. No, if you were going to do a point and click, I would say do like Fuck. the uh, the Discworld ones from PS1 or something like that. Woof. Oh. Or do like one of the visual novel style oh, games, fuck. like freaking uh, Ace Attorney type game. I don't know any of them except for Ace Attorney. And I've never played any of them at all. Uh, you could play one of the Nottery game ones. The what? Uh, what's that other one? Uh, Danganronpa? It's the same type of game as that. Danganronpa? You don't know what that is either? I don't know what a Danganronpa is. It's it's a game where a bunch of characters... It's an anime game where a bunch of characters wake up in this, like, school where one of them is going to die and you have to figure out who the murderer is. So it's Clue? Kind of. There's a whole genre of games in that game style. I've never heard of them. Uh, I had one on my PS Vita. It was called... Oh, I can't remember what it was called. But it was exactly the same concept. You solved puzzles, you tried to figure out who was killing everyone. It was different every time. Oh, so you can't just cheese it and look it up? Uh, it changed depending on how you went through it. And if you wanted to get the entire story, you had to play through it with all the different options. That's kind of funny, but and then, you, you know I would never do that. No, well, it got easier because I was I found out I was actually playing the second game in the series. I didn't know that. But um, what you could do is after you finish the game once, you could go back in time to any point and just choose a different option. So you didn't have to like, play the entire game over again. You could just do one scene. <laughs> That's funny and all. I'd still never do it. Yeah, plus those games can be very frustrating. Hey! 
We beat but the mini boss. I was just thinking of if you wanted to do a game where you do voices, a game like that where it's most it's it's basically a visual novel. Ooh, new additions. You kind of have to do voices. Yeah. Oh, you can play that super abusive game. Oh, what's it called? Uh, I don't like the description um, of that. Jimmy, don't it's an. Die. It's like an RPG that uh, a bunch of streamers played, where it's like super, super difficult, and you have limited saves. I, I may be contradicting myself, but I cannot leave this like that. Why? Oh, I don't know Why if I can remember. Why are you feeling it after we just fought it? Oh, you becoming tiny. Everybody's confused. <gasps> Eat mini camu! Uh, fear and hunger, that's what it's called. That sounds awful. Yeah, it's an incredibly I'm difficult dead. game. It's uh it, it's like the RPG maker version of a FromSoft game. Mm, the white silver dragon healed the savage soul that changed Camu. Deal. Go back to Fa and show her. Just get the fuck out of this damn forest. <laughs> uh, if you if you try and murder him, I'm I'm gonna murder you. <laughs> all right. Yes. Go with the knight and go home, so you don't get murdered on the way back. And all of this was for nothing. Hey, Although to be ass. fair, I I don't think that that's a game that you can finish quickly. No. Yeah, that would have to that would turn into a running series and also it sounds absolutely horrific if you want to see me, if you want to see me actually get mad and frustrated at a game that might be the one we should do it's it's not only horrific in its difficulty but horrific in its themes yeah yeah no it's 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 horrible hmm I wonder if it's, if that is the same game as one I saw a bunch of people reacting to, which has some holy shit questionable scenes in it. Uh, it's an RPG maker game, so I don't know. Uh, th this What's the was other a, one? It was a 2D RPG about a brother and his sister. Uh, this one does not have a brother and a sister in it. Okay, so at least it's not that one, because the, the one I saw was fucked up. This one's in like a medieval world, and you okay, play as like one of not. four different characters. Definitely not. <laughs> but yeah, if you want to see me get super frustrated, we we could potentially look into a game like that. Though that would be probably no, better in no, like today's that, that, time slot. Yeah, yeah, that wouldn't be a that wouldn't be a a group game. You could pick one of the humongous entertainment games and try to play through that in one stream. Humongous entertainment. What's that? Uh, you know, like Spy Fox or Pajama Sam? Spy Fox. That sounds familiar. What are they? It, it's the point and click games I used to play as a kid. Man, both those Fred, sound really Freddy, familiar, but I don't actually know them. Hot Putt, Freddy Fish. Hot Putt? Freddy Fish? No, I don't know those. Yeah, yeah, they're really old point-and-click games that that were like different every time you played through them. Weird. Sounds cool and all, but weird. Yeah, I mean they're they're made for people between the ages of five and ten. So what you're saying so is we it's are a bit advanced probably, for us. Yeah, we're not qualified to solve the puzzles. Yeah, we gon' we we're gonna lose real hard to that one. Oh shit, I should change those additions. Since they both got new additions. More importantly, Congo got a new edition. Hopefully it hits more than I twice. I think of a game that you can finish in one sitting. Those games you could easily finish in one sitting. Look, it doesn't but even have I to don't... be in one sitting. Well, I meant because I will have my computer back after tomorrow. That's fine and all. We can always just continue playing that game at a later date someday. Eh, it'd be easier if we could find something you can finish in one sitting. Unlikely going to happen in the next 24 hours. Well, 23 hours. I can, I can find it. You can find it, and it's going to be one that I approve? And I'm willing to play? Uh, the, possibly. Because that's where the real challenge comes in. 
Possibly. Possibly? Possibly. Ooh, a feeling fog. I'm going to try to think about old PC games because those are probably the easiest to do. Possible. Five ring shattering. All right, Inferno is a three edition, so it'll be minimum four attacks. It's not leveled up though, so it's only at 100% damage, sadly. Oh, I should do a quick save before I cry. One of these days we need to find a way for you to play PT on stream. <laughs> I don't know if that's even possible. It, it is, but very difficult. Also, why would I want to? Because I, have you ever played it? Uh, no. I'd like to see you be terrified. Here's the thing. I saw people playing it, but the puzzle aspects of it are beyond me. I don't fucking like those type of things. And I'm not going to jump at I, everything. I do own a PS4 with PT installed. That's great. We can't stream that, so no. Ah, uh, someone rebuilt it on Unity, I'm pretty sure. Ah, uh, probably. That's a lot of effort that I don't want to go into. Oh, fuck. New additions. Uh, you new know what additions. you can play? You what? could play one of the Five Nights at Freddy's games. I could. I've done that before. That's a one stream type thing. Or me and Kevin you might could, just play more Risk of Rain. You could. You could. You could play, um... Uh... Oh, you could play Slave Aspire. I don't own it. So, no, I can't. What? How do you not own Slave Aspire? I don't care for it? Oh, it's great. Fuck. Ooh. That's gonna be a strong one. It did 120 on a two-hit fail. Fuck. Fuck, 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 I don't think we can get you one of the humongous entertainment games by tomorrow, though, is a problem. Oh, we can play Dragon Slayer. That'd be fun. I don't know what that is. You know what Dragon Slayer is? Oh. It's a game that's been around for, like, 40 years. It's, um... Sort of a choose-your-own-adventure game that had, uh animations done by the guys who did animations for Disney. Weird. Uh, if I showed you images from it, I'm sure you would have seen it at some point in your life. Quite possible. There, there are a lot of games that I never played or, or knew the name of that I just saw somewhere. All right, Melee says so. But you say so. All right, camera's back. Oh, the kid's talking again. Yay, let's go talk to the mayor. Mayor, do you have something to give me? Or are you just useless text information now? Mayor! Mayor! Uh, it's a game that came out in 1983. Mayor, not here? Oh, there's the mayor. Uh, is she... Okay. We didn't, we don't get anything for beating the wolf. Yay. Um. Okay. So, you know what? I think we're gonna call it here because we're getting late. Mm -hmm. Next time we need to go to the other town, which I'll probably just walk over there off stream. Uh, to continue the story. So, yeah. To summarize today, we got past the cringiest of romance dialogue I've ever had the misfortune to read and I read manga uh, we beat the shit out of a dog and ended up saving it and we lost two party members alright though we're gonna call it there so thank you all for watching night Bye.